What's going on, everybody? It's Caleb, and welcome back to Island Survival Season 2. Now, today, guys, as you can tell, I have a different setup. I'm back to the one that I was originally at. And it's because my PS3, I did move it downstairs for a couple of months, and the little box that it was connected to, it can connect more than, more than one HDMI cable, and the box wasn't, like, working properly and all. So... I decided to move it back upstairs and switching the cables between the PS3 and the Xbox One for when my brother like, wants to play in the Xbox One and all. And anyway, so today we're down near the end portal and we're going to be fighting the Ender Dragon. Luckily, I have a bow with infinity on it. So, you know, yeah, so arrows running out of them is not going to be a problem at all. Okay. Entering the end. All right, anyway. So here we are. We've come very far in this series. Now, we have to defeat the final boss, the Ender Dragon. Right, so we got one down. Okay. Enderman after me. Oh god. Alright. Crap. Alright. Anyway. So. You just need to jump back in. We'll be fine. You just need to just get our stuff back like normal. Here's the thing though. I don't have that thing called a pickaxe. Something I don't have. Just gonna have to break this with our bare hands. And it, that sounds painful, punching on end stone with your bare hands. I mean, you know. But I'm trying the Ender Dragon fight without keep inventory on. I want to have a bit of more of a challenge, because sometimes I don't feel like I challenge myself enough when it comes to my different series that I do on Minecraft. I don't feel like I give myself enough of a challenge. Okay, there's my thing. Okay, luckily my golden apple survived. Alright, I should protect myself temporarily to get everything organized again. Oh god. I should at least get my hotbar organized. I should have my extra pickaxe right there. I have my bed as a weapon, actually. I'll show you guys in a minute when it comes Whenever the time comes that I need to use my bed. Because you wouldn't normally use a bed in the nether, but I'll show you what I mean when I do. So I do need my bow with infinity on it. Definitely need that. Okay. Got that down. Good, good. Thing is, those towers is what helps the Ender Dragon regenerate health. So I damage him at least. Alright.
I might actually, I might actually have to climb up there by finding a bunch of blocks and then building up as I go. The golden apples begin to give you absorption for two minutes. I just realized that. I kind of wasted a golden apple, but luckily I've got over 20 of them, so that's not too big of a problem. Okay. I should use this to build up again. Something I've noticed about like when I whenever I fight the Ender Dragon and all is I I die frequently. I know it's kind of a weird thing to say, you know. Okay. Have another golden apple. Oh crap. Okay, alright. Alright. Just mine all the way down. So quiet in the end right now. It doesn't have that music playing. And also, guys, I have, have to, most of you know this already, but I got I have reached 60 subscribers. So I have a pretty I have a decent following. So I wanted to thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. And being a member of my gang. I'm, I need to come up with a cool name for for my subscribers. To call my subscribers. I need to come up with a really cool name. Because my channel is called The Caleb and all. And... Mine down. We need to be careful with this. Okay. Oh my! My pickaxe is broke. Okay. Luckily, we have extra inventory space for other various items. Okay. We 
You're seeing beast mode now with the ball. Luckily, I will never run out of arrows because I have infinity on this bow. So that won't be a problem. Let's get him in the face. I'm not doing like the best amount of damage right now, but it's at least somewhat effective. Hopefully we didn't lose our bow at all. Where'd he go? Okay, he's up there. Alright. I think my controller's bugging now. But keep in mind, I did buy my PlayStation 3 used, so that's another thing. So it's not like the greatest, most mint of consoles. But so I've been taking I've been taking PS3 over Xbox One a lot lately. I haven't played on my Xbox One in like forever. My brother's been playing on it, though, so at least it's getting the love that it deserves. I mean, because all consoles deserve good love by good gamers. You know? Anyway. Yeah, he's running low on health. He knows that this is the end of him. Oh, I hit him that time. Just noticed that he turned red. Alright. Dragon has perished. Then it rains down all this awesome experience. All these levels. It's so awesome. Take a torch. So the dragon egg should have went to like the rank location. Okay, all right. So it's right here. This is a really good method for grabbing the egg after you're done in the end. So dragon eggs they fall just like sand, gravel, and anvils. So when you mine this, there you go. You've got the dragon egg. Now, anyway. Let's go back up, and let's get back to business, get back to getting back home. Alrighty, let's jump up, grab this, and that. Alright. Yeah, I feel pretty accomplished today, actually, because... 
you know, what I noticed is that I only died once, and I didn't have keep inventory on. So, this was a whole lot more challenging than, like, other, other fights I've had with the same boss. But anyways, guys, yeah. This is my world. It's almost entirely ocean. So that's my underwater house. You know, I've, I've got quite a bit of time to kill, so I, I actually want to show you guys some of my some stuff that I've made in this world. So that's my underwater house that I have. And then over there is my island where I enchant things. So like, a lot of a lot of them, a lot of builders in Minecraft have. If you like, like certain players in Minecraft that are passionate about building and surviving at the same time, they like make separate structures for different things. Like that island over there, that's my enchanting island, and this right here is my. It's my underwater house. So, so I've got my little TV area. It's not the best TV in the world. It's made, it's made of nether brick and cobblestone. It's my kitchen. My little place to eat and all. And then, it's my bedroom. And then, it's got glass over it, which is cool. Then I have a little tree that I grew under the ocean. It's my little area where I, where I can collect obsidian and stuff like that. If I ever need it. And yeah. That's where I've stored extra materials. This is my brewing room. And in here, this is another place where I can access the nether if I need to go there. If I ever need to go there. Check that out. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Alright. And then you guys have seen my main house before tons of times. Anyway. Then we go up and yeah so that's my main house over there and then I have a railroad that goes across this island I think you guys have probably seen it before and then there's my island over there that I enchant stuff with if you see that little house thing in the distance that's made of bookshelves actually I actually collected all those books from the stronghold but then I had to cut down so many trees to recreate them into bookshelves again so yeah, I mean, you know, let's probably place a torch here. It'll be good. Anyway, anyways guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this series. If you did, make sure to leave a like and to subscribe to this channel to grow my family. Anyways, I will see you next time.